How's it going everybody? Welcome back. And today I'm showing you guys a quick tutorial on how to download Surfshark and how you can basically make use of Surfshark. It's a very easy to use VPN. So let's get straight into it. Now, all you want to do is, uh, first of all, what you can do is get Surfshark. And then once you subscribe, they'll send you an email and you can use that link to download the application. Or you can go to the download section right here of the website and download it on whatever device you're using it on. And once you download it, keep clicking next until it's fully installed and you'll have this right here. Uh, of course, this is the user interface, very straightforward. You have a quick connect button that will connect you to the closest server or whatever it is, whatever server you actually uh, set it to. I set it to the New York server right here. So if I click quick connect, it'll just connect me to New York. Or what you can do is just click one of these locations. You have over 3,200 servers in 99 countries. You have a couple of specialty servers right here. Uh, and let's just go ahead and disconnect. The static IP servers are going to give you the same IP address every time you return to one of these servers. So main four is always going to have the same IP address, whereas these regular servers will give you different IP addresses every time you connect and reconnect. Multi-hop servers will route your connection through two servers instead of just one for double the encryption. And if we go to the settings, you have just a few settings right here. Very simple, nothing too complicated. Again, the quick connect button, which you can set to a specific server. Uh, you have some auto connect features right here and you can set your preferences depending on the network if you want to add some trusted networks to it clean web which is the ad blocker the kill switch which will disconnect your internet connection when the vpn disconnects unexpectedly preventing any rare ip leaks uh, you have a few protocols stick to the wire guard for the best connection the bypasser feature which is also known as split tunneling will allow you to choose which applications are routed through the vpn and which are not you can also select which websites and ip addresses you want to have bypass the vpn you have the speed test feature, which will save you the time of having to manually test these servers to figure out which one is the fastest for you. Uh, and you have a couple of features right here that'll help you if you're any censorship heavy country. So that is pretty much it for Surfshark. Now that you've figured out how uh, this works and what these features are for, all you need to do is just look for the right type of server. So let's say you're trying to unblock BBC iPlayer, which is only available in the UK, you want to connect to a UK server. So in this case, you just select a server, click on it, and it will connect you. Uh, and that is pretty much it. So if you guys are interested in Surfshark, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below if you want to jump straight to that. And of course, you'll find a full review if you'd like to learn more about the privacy policy, speed streaming and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. And that's pretty much it for this video. Of course, Surfshark is covered by a 30 day money back guarantee. So in case you're not satisfied for whatever reason, you can get yourself a quick refund. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.